Hey guys, Alicia McGill. I'm going to show you how to do problem A.1.5 or problem A50 from A.1.5. I made this template and you can put it in a sleeve and students can, you can use hot potato and kind of do one step at a time. But first you want to get the students to practice building and solving um, these equations. So the first one is 1 plus 2x. So there's my 2x. Uh, subtract x, you can put that down here, equals <clears throat> x. So there's my x. And there's minus 5. So you could either, the students should know at this point that you could either subtract this positive 5 down here, or that's the same as adding a negative so that they can do it there as well. Either or is fine at this point. Okay, and then plus x. So there's the equation. So that's the first thing that's given. So step one, they're just going to write out the equation and build it. Okay? Then you're going to practice with them until they can use hot potato and do this with their teams. But next step, I'm going to flip everything from the negative region to the positive region. And that gives us 1 plus 2x minus x equals 2x minus 5. And the reason is I flipped from negative to positive. Okay? Then the next step, what I'm going to do here is I'm going to say, okay, I need to remove the zero pair so I can take you away. And that's it. So remove zero pair. So I'm left with x plus 1 equals 2x and that minus 5. And then I'm trying to get x alone, and I have x's on both sides. So if I take away this x and take away this x, they know that's a legal move. So I am left with 1 equals x minus 5. And basically my justification is I removed an x from both sides. And then that last step, to get this x alone, you could add zero pairs, or they know that if they flip this to the other side, basically what they're doing is adding 5 to both sides. Adding 5 to make that 0, adding 5 to that side, and then x equals 6. So there's my reason, my justification. I added 5 to both sides, and there's my solution. You can have the students check that. Do a few with them, and then they can do hot potato and do one at a time. Um, I also provided a template for the problem where they can start with a sketch and then kind of a mini version. You can do two problems here, and you can copy it two on the back. A lot of these problems, um, there's four, like A59, A, B, C, D, A50, A, B, C, D. So um, what you can do is use this template over and over. There's one for expressions and one for equations. Hope that was helpful. 